those who give me the courage to fight for justice. I'm the fourth generation in my family to have cancer since 1945, and now I have a 23-year-old niece that was diagnosed with thyroid cancer like I was. She's had her life upended, and we now know in my family who's next, because we don't ask if we're gonna get cancer, we ask when. And that is what the US government left behind for us. That is the legacy. I have a son and a grandson, and they bear those genetics. And that's why I do this work also. Because I can't stand or bear the thought that someday I will see one of my precious grandsons have to go through what my niece is going through right now. I can't thank you all enough for what you do by raising up our voices. accomplished so much in his life to organize and put our bodies on the line, he said. So it's such a great honor to be here with Dan's son, Robert, uh, to be here with Klaus, who started Nuclear Free, and the key word is future. Oh,